What's going on guys? Today I will be showing you how to change your APN on your iPhone 5 or your iPhone 4S for straight talk. Um, I've got settings here which you can find these settings on um, straight talk's website I do believe or the little um, booklet that comes with straight talk. Now um, you cannot change the APN settings on the iPhone 5 unless it's unlocked or unless you jailbreak but um, you can do this thing called sim swap to where you can change the APN on the iPhone without having to jailbreak or have it unlocked um, if, um, if you're good with um, following directions or anything you should be able to do this video alright here what I have is a T-Mobile can't really see it T-Mobile nano sim card um, it's not activated or anything. Um, you'll need this to change the APN. Okay. If you have an iPhone 4S, you'll need either a micro T-Mobile SIM card or you'll need a SIM card adapter, as I'm showing here. I, I bought this off of eBay for like five bucks. All right. And then you'll need, of course, your APN settings, which I'll put down in the description. All right. Well, I'll show you how to do this. You'll need a SIM eject tool. What you'll do, you'll eject the SIM card. Now, whenever you do this, um, I have had this problem before. Whenever I restored my phone or whenever I updated it. Um, now I don't know if this is for all iPhones, but um, if I didn't leave my after I updated, if I didn't leave my SIM card in there for um, five minutes or so to let it know that it's been reactivated, that it would, um, every time I'd go to do this, if I wasn't fast enough, it would say, act, it kicked the phone out and say, activate phone again. It'd bring up the Apple SIM one and take you to the activation steps again. Now, uh, if you're fast enough, like I'm fixing to show you, then you can do it with no problem. Anyways, what you do is you go to settings, you go to general. Okay, you see that cellular says on. Alright, it's lit up black, as in you can click on it. Um, eject your SIM card. Put the T Mobile one in. Hit OK. Wait till it pops up. And then you'll click on Sell Your Data Network. Then you'll eject it. And you gotta do this kind of quick. Put your Straight Talk SIM card back in it. And then click on APN. Type in ATT dot MVN0. If you can see that or not, ATT dot MVN zero, just like that. I'll put a zero instead of P. Dot MVN zero. Kind of hard for me to see the type because the camera's in the way. All right. Then on the MMSC, you're going to put. H T T P. Come on, my camera focus. Well, I'll put the um, put the settings down there below in the description. That way, only thing I do is just pause this video, scroll down, and type them in. Go ahead and enter these in. Now after this I will show you that it does work. 
Okay, once you get this typed in right here. Now the uh, internet tethering, uh, this doesn't work. You still have to go through AT&T services apparently to set it up. But of course I'm using Straight Talk, so it's not going to matter. And then when I scroll back up here, as you can see, sell your data is AT&T.MVNO, MMSAPN, AT&T.MVNO. My camera won't focus, so I really can't show you that. Um, like I said, I'll have the settings down below if you can't really see this on camera. If you have to, if you can see it, just pause the video and type it in. Alright, once you get those settings in, double tap the home key and just go to like the internet. Let's type in, let's see. Google. Now I am on four or three G, which says four G, but it really isn't four G where I'm at. Alright. Now no, I don't have Wi Fi on, and you do see it says home. Okay. Set this down. Now, um, hold on just a second. Let's choose a picture. Uh, send this weed eater. Choose. Send. I'm not on Wi Fi, and of course, I am on the um, cellular network. Now, sometimes, if it doesn't work the first time on this, um, you might have to restart the phone and try again. And if it still doesn't work, just go through this video again and follow my steps again. Which it should send. Now there is a, another way to um, get your internet to working on your phone without having to do this with the T-Mobile. But the MMS does not work that way. Um, you can go to unlockit.cl.nz and you can choose your um, if you're using straight talk or net 10 I used that for a while until I figured out how to do this it might take a little bit to sim because I've only got one bar but if it wasn't going to send then there it goes as you can see it sent and now my wife's going to be complaining that I'm bothering her from her movie Anyways, alright guys, let me show you the other way that I was talking about. Go to Safari. Now, if you're going to do it this way, have your Wi-Fi on before you do this. Okay, go up here. Unlock it. C O. N Z. Now what this does is it will install a profile on your phone to enable it to be able to use the internet. Now the only other way that I know to be able to send pictures using this instead of having to change the APN or unlock the phone is to download like a TextNow app and send it like that because then it uses cellular to send it over that. But turn my Wi-Fi on that way. See now whenever you come back to settings it'll look like this and then you just exit out because you know it's already working. Alright. Um, go back to Safari. Okay now when it comes up to this you tap or you click on create APN you select it which will be straight talk so scroll all the way down to you see straight talk then you hit OK then you'll hit create APN and then it'll do this and then you hit install but since I've already got my APN settings on my phone set cancel 
which that's what I'm going to do. Anyways, guys, that's how you change the APN settings on your phone without having to unlock it or jailbreak it. Um, if there's anything else you want to know about the iPhone, just leave a comment down below if you're having problems. Hopefully, I can help. Um, if you like this video, like it, um, share it with your friends, subscribe if you you know for further videos. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Until next video.